First at six, a lot more calm tonight in a Morrisville neighborhood as state police investigated a home that may have been a popular drug spot. Neighbors told us they've watched sales happen at the home for more than a year now and were happy to see police finally arrive. ABC 22's Matt Holderman was on scene. State police have been investigating at this home on Center Road for multiple hours now, and you can still see some of that investigation going on behind me here. They are looking through the trunk of this red Jeep and have all four doors open on it. They've also been looking through the house itself and have even pushed out a screen window on the top floor. The police operation began late Monday morning with multiple state police units staying on scene for a couple hours and a few troopers staying behind a little longer once the main investigation wrapped up. During their searches, police could be seen around the property and in all levels of the home and even placed evidence markers inside of the Jeep at one point. State police only told us this was an operation and wouldn't provide any further details other than saying no arrests were made, no one was hurt, and there is no ongoing danger to the public. However, I did talk with people living nearby off camera and they told me they've seen drug deals go on at the house numerous times over the past year if not longer, oftentimes being woken up in the middle of the night by a activity going on at the house. One person told me they'd even brought their concerns to investigators earlier in the year and were told that police were already looking into sales of heroin, fentanyl, cocaine, and pills that they knew were taking place at the house. State police did not confirm any of this information, but the locals told me they were thrilled to see police finally arrive and begin their search. And state police officials say they can't provide any additional details at this time or confirm anything additional as they don't want to compromise the integrity of their their investigation as it moves forward. For now, reporting in Morrisville, Matt Holderman, ABC 22 News.